you know, we jump out to a three-goal lead. Um, where teams are in the standings at this time of the year, uh, been a lot of those different games on both sides of the equation, and you kind of kind of just feel that some nights aren't going to be perfect, and, and you're going to have to grind one out and, and uh, you know, maybe just outscore the other team, and that's what we had to do tonight. Um, you know, we let them hang around a little bit, uh, especially in the second period, and, uh, you know, then they jumped on, on us in the third, and we had to, uh, like I said, respond, so... It's good we came out with the win. Not a Picasso by any stretch, um, but our, what I liked was uh, even though it wasn't a perfect night, our our team found a way uh, to grind it out when uh, things weren't going our way in the third period. But we found a way to to make a difference and and get the two points. We're not going to bury our heads in the sand and and. Um, you know, just pretend that there weren't things in our game that have to get cleaned up. We will address those. Um, I was talking with Brad Lauer this morning. I had a coffee with him and his staff in his room, and he, he used a great line, and he said, you know, they're, the wins are pieces of art, but you don't always hang uh, every pitcher in the living room. Sometimes you hang them in the basement. And I thought it was a really smart way of putting it. And that uh, Brad's a really funny guy, and, you know, I'm going to... I'm going to steal that one because I think it uh, adequately describes tonight's game.